Oh. <laughs> oh. Knock, knock. <laughs> Nicole, Ronald, who's ready for Bob? <laughs> All right, guys, welcome back to another episode. I'm your host, T. I'm Tasha. And uh, welcome to TNT Reactions. So yeah. today we are going to be doing some more Family Guy. Finally. Yes. It's about time you joined me yeah, for Family yeah, Guy yeah. Reaction. So uh, there's been an uh, interesting revelation that's what? happened. Uh, you recently revealed to me that you enjoy Family oh, Guy more yeah. than South Park now. Yeah. South Park is, is not what it used to be. Mm. And I really stopped watching it. Okay. I think I might go back and watch like older episodes, like with Michael Jackson and mm. celebrities on the plane. Okay, um, that those are my favorite episodes. But um, Family yep. Guy is starting Family to take Guy over now. Um, because they're like consistent. Yeah, right. Yeah, it's consistently so. funny. Yeah. Well, the older episodes are definitely more funny than the newer ones. But let's go ahead and jump into it, y'all. Let's bring this up. And, uh, and let's go. You should see this. Your dishwasher cartoon has really outraged the online community. What? Gosh, it's not like the internet to go crazy about something small and stupid. Peter, right. you have to apologize. What, because of a joke? Not just a joke, Peter. A joke that angered some bloggers. <sighs> well, I guess Thank this ain't you. the first time I got in trouble for something I said about a woman. Oh, good. We can steal. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. okay. He, wait, here's another one. Why do women have boobs? So you got something to look at while you're talking to them. <laughs> <laughs> that's, 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 good one, that's what they're for, all right. Are you telling jokes? <laughs> I love jokes. Oh, all right, then I you'll love, love this one. Okay. Oh, no. Why do women have boobs? So you got something to look at while you're talking to them. Supposed to change the joke, Peter. So you got something to look at while you're talking to them. She's stunned. Her face is in shock. <laughs> so you got... You you uh you wanted to see me, Mr. Weed? Mr. Weed. <laughs> That's funny. Peter, your comic in this morning's paper is really offensive. <laughs> <laughs> he threw oh, his wife. Yeah. He used to return his wife he to the his, shop. No, he his wife with the dishwasher. <laughs> oh man. That's not funny, Peter. Ah, you're just not getting it, Lois. See, his wife washed dishes for him. Oh, for Pete's sake. <laughs> ah, there you go. Well, I have to get to work, Chris. I have tons and tons of dogs to incinerate, but I can't wait oh. to see you tomorrow night. Oh, God, oh. I'm so sorry. I'll clean that up. Oh, uh, that's okay. I'll get it. Have fun at work. Okay. Bye, Chris. <laughs> what do you girlfriend. think you're doing? What? You, a man, are cleaning up a mess made by Anna, a woman, that she, also a woman, spilled on you, a man. So? You're treating her like a human being. If you oh. want to get anywhere with a chick, you can't treat him too nice-like. Really? Oh. Trust me, Chris. The next time you see this girl, treat her like crap. And you'll be cooler than a mid-80s novelty answering machine message. <laughs> you know, a lot of people think that way. A lot of guys think that way, that women prefer assholes. Oh. Uh. But my thing is, and cause you, I think you think that way. That is it, so not true. <laughs> it, it, you know the craziest thing. Let me just say this: the craziest thing. Cause guys swear women don't like nice guys. Um, you don't like nice guys who pretend they're nice. <laughs> cause they're just being nice to you because they find you attractive. <sighs> and women know that. <sighs> Oh, man. And the guys who try to be assholes, and I guess you got to do it to insecure women. Like, oh, my God, everybody likes me, but this guy, he doesn't. He's treating me like a normal person, or he's treating me like shit. So he he must be different. You laughing because you think it works. <laughs> it don't. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. All right. Um, let's keep going, y'all. <laughs> I don't know. I did everything Dad said. Uh, I should have known Peter had something to do with this. You're not the first person whose life he screwed up. See his... Oh. <laughs> oh. Knock, knock. <laughs> Nicole, Ronald, who's ready for Boggle? <laughs> oh, my no. God. No. <laughs> Why? Why? My beautiful Nicole. My man Ronald, who did this? <laughs> oh man, they were so good together. We oh, were just establishing our friendship. They were about Damn. to get engaged. Oh. oh, he was gonna ask me to be an usher. 
I mean, he already had enough groomsmen, so he made me an usher. But just to think I could be involved in the ceremony in any way. Oh, um, man. That's terrible. I have terrible. a question. They're wrong. I went on a date with this girl that I really like, and if you don't mind, I was hoping I could ask you a few questions about the birds and the bees. Ah, my boy wants to know about sex. Came to the right place. Chris, what you always want to remember <laughs> no, is that sex is perfectly natural. Well, uh, uh, sorry, Mr. Swanson, um, I wasn't really talking to you. Chris, oh. I know a lot about sex. Yeah, and I'm sure you have fond memories, but I was kind of hoping <laughs> to get some advice from someone who isn't broken from the waist down. I'm a father! You're a two-wheeled monster! Oh, oh. my goodness. <laughs> That's gonna be my ringtone. Quagmire, call me. <laughs> Chris, camp is only That's as fun funny. as you make it. That's how it was in World War II. Oh. Don't suppose it would help to say I have a note from my doctor. <laughs> Get in there, you. Women, Damn. we have spent decades fighting for our right to vote. So when you go to those booths and cast your ballot, remember, Warren G. Harding is way the cutest! <laughs> we need to stop taking responsibility for his health. So I decided to sign him up for fat camp. What? Mom, I don't want to go to fat camp. I'm sorry, sweetie. It's for your own good. And trust me, you'll feel much better about yourself. Everyone's gonna make fun of me. Uh. Oh, come on. Who's gonna make fun of you? Hey, fatty, I hear you're going to fat camp. <laughs> That's where you belong. Peter, stop it. And I better not see you at the big dance. Come on, you. <laughs> sorry, Chris. I I'm gonna go with you. <laughs> he had a letterman jacket yeah, like yeah. he was a bully in high school. Yeah. That is hilarious. <laughs> now, you know what? Uh, watching it, it does make me think about like how back in the day, they did have fat camp. So that oh. they had a camp where you could send lose your kid weight. and lose weight and get in shape and everything. Yeah. But I, I wonder what they call it now. Yeah, you can't call it fat camp. Because you can't camp. call it fat camp. Maybe yeah. weight loss camp. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Mm, there you go. Hanks, that's it. Ah, oh, funny guy, Tom Hanks. Everything he says is a stitch. I have AIDS. <laughs> Stewie, did Mr. Right. Dom... Can we go back to the vet and see... I'm sorry. Whether it's South Park or whether it's Family Guy, I love when yeah, they do Michael, Michael Jackson, Jackson jokes. jokes. Oh, yeah. Because it's so... so it's so... Almost inappropriate yeah. that it makes it funny. It's when they push the line. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Be the pretty vet assistant again. Well, I guess if Brian gets sick again. Oh boy! Hey Brian, look! <laughs> oh. Brian's sick. Mom, get your keys. Serious. Your friends are terrorists. Think about it. They're, they're meeting in secret. They're creating cover stories. Oh my God! You're right. See, I told you my mood was bad news. Those guys are all bad news. Uh, hang on there, Quagmire. Just because these few guys are terrorists doesn't mean all Muslims are. Every ethnic group has their nut jobs. We have the Unabomber, Timothy McVeigh, and even that fat guy at the Atlanta Olympics who didn't do it, but he looked mean, so we said oh. he did. Team should I like? My mood says we all need to act like we're fans of American football, so we seem less... suspicious. <laughs> what? What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm talking about my mood. You know, I actually feel really bad for him. Do you know he knew 19 guys who died on 9-11? I mean, what are the odds? Peter, I think you joined a terrorist sleeper cell. What? That's crazy. Look, I'm going to call Mahmood right now on this cell phone he gave me. He'll tell you. It's a trap phone. A burner phone. Oh. <laughs> Maybe I dialed wrong. Oh! <laughs> Peter, please oh, stop trying to call Mahmood. <laughs> oh, I think that's, that's me. Terrible. Hello? Oh. Hey, hey, Peter, it's Quagmire. Oh, hey, Quagmire. Guess what? Last night I had sex with a black chick. Uh, uh, I, I, I gotta go. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. What? All he said was black chick. Yeah, I know, but your boyfriend looks like one of your typical angry black guys, and I, I didn't want to offend him. <laughs> hey, we cool, oh. G? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Who is this man? Why would you bring him here? Do not worry. This is Peter. He believes in our cause. How can you be sure? Give him the test. Who is better, Hulk Hogan or the Iron Sheik? Um, the Iron Sheik? Okay, he is one of us. I told you. Look at him. He is the perfect man to help us blow up the Quahog Bridge. Oh. Ah! Oh my god! Everybody down! So are these toys just like to take? Oh. 
Peter, where are you going, and why are you dressed like that? Well, Lois, I happen to be a Muslim now, which means I'll be spending a lot of my time in mostly empty cafes, watching soccer on an eight-inch black-and-white TV. Yes, the team I like is kicking it. Oh, no, the team I don't like is kicking it. Yes, the team I like is kicking it again. I will celebrate with finger symbols. <laughs> hey, is that for real, that, that diarrhea-only sign on your bathroom? Post-9-11 racism talking. I, for one, think it's great that Peter has enough of an open mind to have a Muslim friend. You know, a lot of dogs just sit outside, tied to poles. Look, Mahmoud's my friend, okay? <laughs> so he's Muslim. Every culture has its quirks. Italian guys talk with their hands a lot. Irish guys drink a lot. Black guys change their shirts while they tell you a story. So how's Bernadette? She's all right. She's taking interior design classes down at the community college. I mean, she's good at haircutting and everything. They gave her the chair right by the door. But I guess now she wants to hang plates on the wall or whatever. And you know she gained the weight back from the lap band, right? That Bernadette. Yeah, her... you laughing really hard. Is that yeah. like, true? No, no, no. I mean, not the shirt to uh, thing, but him just talking. Oh, you know, it's funny. Oh, okay. He's like, she's all right. Hi. <laughs> you know it, brother. Okay, I'm gonna go eat this steak in the bathroom. Thanks for getting dinner, man. So, I see you graduated number one in your class from Princeton. That's right, and I'm certified as an accountant and also have a law degree. That's all very impressive. We'll keep you in mind. Hmm. Let's see, pointy boobs, medium pointy boobs, Aww. not so pointy boobs. Aww. That's a shame. <laughs> Excuse me, now that your family is gone, would you mind if we turn on the TV? Oh, hey, I didn't know anyone was here. I, uh, I was just kidding when I told my family I loved them. He even brought Callista Flockhart with him. Uh, Peter, I think that's just a piece of paper. Good, because oh. she looks fat. Get in the car. Damn. What? Why? You'll see. Why should I trust you? You're always tricking me into going places I don't want to. Oh, you said uh, we were going to a place Walt Disney built. No, Peter, I said supported. Oh. <laughs> wow. Broke my vacuum. <laughs> uh, wow. So yeah. this was this wasn't dark Stars humor to me. It was more like it was more misogynistic, misogynistic yeah. Uh, jokes. Yeah, yeah. But it was still hilarious. And yeah. it's like Family Guy. These guys, they, it's like Family Guy is not afraid to push the envelope. And That's I what and makes I it love funny. these. Um, I, I I I love the humor that's in here, and it's really funny, especially if you can take a joke, because yeah. they don't spare anyone. They yeah, ro they roast everyone, joke. whether you're Jewish, Black, Muslim, they don't care. So, and yeah. to me, that's what makes it funny. Because right, exactly. It's not like they're just picking on one people. Right, exactly. And you know, we need laughter in this world, Definitely. especially with what's going on, because it's just a crazy world out there. Definitely. But guys, leave your thoughts down below in the comment section. Let us know what you thought about this. Uh, <laughs> Uh, this Family Guy uh, compilation. As always, like, share, and subscribe. We'll see y'all next time. Take Ta -ta. care.